guys, any of you would add into that? No? I think it would be important to ask what the group would like in terms of support as next steps or what they would envision. Yeah. You know? Like, what would you, as a group, after this weekend, what would you like to see as a continuance in terms of support in your visioning and in your in your next steps? Definitely some sort of um, some e e so a way to follow up, though, mm -hmm. without feeling like we're I'm encroaching on your your time. Okay. So, like, um, yeah, not feeling like well, the conference is over. That you know, we're done. Um, but that we can actually sort of have a, a set follow up. Um, you know, whether talking or email, and just but yeah, that's almost like it's to be expected and not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Know, not bothering you. I, I got some ideas around past you. So maybe a forum of some place yeah. where you can kind of come and go and kind of log in and check on each other. Your lunch once a month. Yeah. For those that want to show up, just time and a place. We're going to be there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I guess I mean, you guys are, are are local, and I'll definitely you know seek you out. But you know. For the um, other coaches and guides that don't live here, or if you do this, you know, a few other times, you have different people. You know, they could be from all over the place. But how to, uh, you know, especially if you resonate with a particular coach, how to set that up? And maybe, obviously, that happens without it being you know, formal. People exchange numbers or emails, but I guess sometimes I just. You know, I, I don't want to feel like I'm taking up your time after the fact. Yeah, I mean, I look at this, sorry, I look at this uh, operation, I look at these yellow boxes, and I think that's probably the most intimidating thing I've thought about doing all weekend. I mean, if I knew the answer of how to find that funding, that's my biggest bridge, then uh, I'd already be running an eight-week day camp. Um, you know, so it's, uh, I, yeah, I think it is that support of, Coaches that have such great ideas. Well, I was just going to speak for myself. I mean, um, to, to your to your point of not wanting to feel like you're asking for something that you you shouldn't be asking for or whatever. From my perspective, it's you know uh, you definitely should be asking, you know, and if you ask me it's it's a privilege for me you know and if it's uh it's a privilege for me the first time you ask it's a privilege for me the second third time you know whatever so uh, there's there's to me just the opposite of oh should i ask or not uh should i you know whatever it is uh, uh so it's hard to say it any other way than it, it, it'd be a privilege. 